<laughs> well, I'm Monica Farrier, and because my name was Monica Hull, and I got married from here in 1961 to my husband Brian. And why did you move in to here? Why did we move into here? Because we moved from, we used to live in Sheffield Road, and then my father got transferred to, for the firm he worked for, and we had a, a bungalow called Scalwith in Spaldhurst. And we were there for a number of years. And then the people that used to look after my aunt, Isabella Clara, they moved away and we came in and looked after her. And she was famous because of her surname. Well, I'm sure she was famous for what she did as well, but <laughs> she was partly famous. What was her surname? Uh, Isabella Clara Gallard. And she was the last one to live in this house. I think 1952 she died. And then my brother was born in 54. And then consequently my other brother was born in, the same, in this house, which I can show you the room where he was born. So, so going back to what you were saying, the, the people who rented, what were their names? Frankel. Again? Frankel. Frankels. And did they, um, did they rent the house without Isabella here? They rented 34. Oh, there. Oh, I see. They did, okay. Yes, because I wasn't aware that there was a door adjoining. So did she own that house as well? She owned that. Ah. So Gallon must have built, I mean, I'm not certain, he must have built these houses, these two. That's that what we're I guessing. don't know. We never did find out mm. because as a child you weren't really interested no, in that, were no. you? When was this house built? You know, eighteen fifties, I think, because I found they they said eighteen forties, but I found the um, plot for sale that was uh, going up for sale at the Hand and Scepter uh, and or the pub down the road actually, and that was eighteen forty nine. So they would have had to have been really quick to put the put the houses up wouldn't yeah, they yes, would. mm. so I reckon it must have been early 1850s mm, mm. Um, but we were We've... told that two, it was built for two sisters and they had a connecting door and we just we didn't know anything about that but then when the neighbours had their room done I think there, it was that they, one actually oh, was it that one they found yeah. a connecting door I went over the other side and they were taking away all the plasterwork right. and you can mm. see the br it was filled in <coughs> from the brick brickwork behind the plasterwork it was actually built by the Gallards well, well, we've we got no so. proof, we but think we think so. so. And the man from the Gallard Society, he thought so, because there's a drain cover out there. The well, there's a CJ, yeah, there's a mm -hmm. CJ Gallard, yeah. which was the son. No, because we know who used to live there, the Stills. He used to be, he took over Gallard's builders, VN Still and Harmer, Still and Harmer, they were called. He took it over. So Mr. Still, I don't know if he's alive, but his two children must be alive. Carol, and I can't think of the other daughter's name. Um, so they might have lots of records. Yes, yes. But where they are at the moment, they were living in Lamberhurst, but the, she married and they divorced, so I don't quite know where they are now. So yes, because we were trying to find the deeds of the house too, weren't we? And we didn't have much luck. Well, I think the land registry now just throw everything away, yeah. I've decided, mm, mm. which is terrible. But of course, this is all one room, as I say. You couldn't see through to They there. describe what was, what was well, here. Well, there was a huge, great mahogany um, wardrobe. It was not built in as such, but it was there, so you couldn't move it around. It obviously was brought to put there. Whether they did make it, I don't know. With a big bureau in the front and other doors. I don't know how you'd get went... it out if it was that big. <laughs> well, they, they obviously did. I don't know, Barry, how you managed to get it out. I don't remember it. Yet. No. No, but it was there. Yes, yeah. Because my mum and dad, when Isabella Clara died, they came down and they slept down here. Because my mother what? was ill. She was a manic depressive. Oh, okay. She probably know. So why, but why would they come down here? Because it's quite it's cold. damp and yes. cold down here. Well, Whereas upstairs, you've got the lovely well, views. Well, upstairs, right upstairs, they let mm. it to Mr. and Mrs. Chaplin, who you discovered the name. Yeah, it was on the, Kell the Kellys. And um, there was a big tin, or not tin, I suppose it was a metal chest, which was loaded of silver and stuff. And Mr. Chaplin sold it because he was to do with antiques. And I think all we had left was one silver teapot. Where that went, I don't know. It's nice of him. Mm. My mother and father didn't want upstairs because there was only three of them, so they let upstairs and they made the kitchen into the little green room which is up there, I don't know if it's still a little room called the green room. You know, as you go up the stairs, it was on your right, there was a little tiny room. Mm -hmm. We used to keep all the you know, bottled stuff with kilner jars and this sort oh, of thing. Oh, they made that into a kitchen? They did eventually when Mr and Mrs Chaplin, and then we had a young couple. After they went, this young couple moved in. Who, 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 were that? who was that? Can't remember their names. Can't remember their names because oh. Mr. And Mr. Chapman long gone. 
but that's what they did. They stole all. So. <laughs> Where was it kept then? Somewhere in the house? It, it? it was obviously, and we were away. It wasn't kept in their premises, obviously. No, so no. they must have, you know, because we, around. because we knew them. So we didn't lock up or do anything. No, we couldn't really. Oh. They'd all come in through the yeah, same front door exactly. anyway. Yes. And we never used to lock the front door, as you know. A lot of people didn't in those days, did they? <laughs> we just went out and that was it. So. And then, of course, the bed was here. And then, of course, when the Salvation Army came, when the lovely lawn was there, they used to stand outside with a band and that, and these windows went up. Love and, that. And my aunt was laying in bed because she loved the Salvation Army. She wasn't Salvation Army. She was St Peter's Church, of course. And then, of course, here, we, she used to, we used to have a brand tub down the corner there, Christmas. A what tub? A brand tub. Brand tub. You know when these boxes used to move? They used to give you um, a sort of wooden boxes to put all your moving stuff oh, in. Oh, no? tea, tea, tea chest. Yes. That's right. And we used to, call, well, right. we had a tub. It wasn't actually a tea chest. It was a round thing made okay. of that sort of stuff. Mm -hmm. And we used to have all, um, salt, was it sawdust? Yes. It, no, it wasn't sawdust. It was a bit bigger than sawdust. And she used to dress up as Father Christmas and stand in that corner because she had lovely white hair and a lovely Christmassy robe <laughs> on. Amazing. The piano was there. Because there was no, there was a wall there. Yes. Lovely piano there, and then on this side was another, the same mahogany as the wardrobe was all along here, all along there. A big, which Barry took out and had in your bungalow, didn't you, in Sheffield Road? What's that? Do you remember that? It was a lovely um, sideboard. Oh yes, the um, all right. The river, yes. Four door thing. Which you've got, yeah, 12, huge, foot huge long, was, yes. all along there. Yes. Wow. Oh, you should send place. us a photo of that. Oh, I haven't and got it. The, I didn't um, take photos. Because they've gone, haven't they? Because it was the... What was the, well, so I what was the fireplace all, like? All the fireplaces went from this house. So yes. this yeah, one well, was, was put in. Under impression it was still the same one. No, that's been no, put, put in. No, definitely wasn't that. Because you had to bow what? things around here. You used to pull yes, to get the servants, servants to come yeah. in. Yeah. So, so what sort of fireplace was it? Was it a wooden thing like that? Can you No, I don't think it was, but I can't really remember that. Similar. Because yeah, a lot of the similar. houses have these really sort of dark, Blacky, uh, black ones. Yes, yeah. yes, that's right. Yeah, but I mean... And did they ever have, did you ever have a fire then? Oh then? yes, always. You did. No central you? heating. I mean, we didn't have a central heating when we first married. We moved into a bungalow. We used to have paraffin. You imagine what paraffin <laughs> does to a, a new bungalow, which we had in Canterbury, didn't that's we? Right, we did. Oh, dreadful. Because it brings all the, the damp out of a new build. Which does in any room paraffin, doesn't it? Horrible. I was sick, sick for three months. And the, oh. <laughs> and the other wonderful thing was the ceiling. You said yes. that there were things coming off we that ceiling. We had a mantle ways. there. Yes, uh, we had the mantle. Gas mantle. Yeah, gas mantle with two chains, wasn't it, Barry? Was it? Three, you you remember that? No. No, I remember Dad had put that looks the same. Yeah. The same. No, there was a mantle there. So you pulled one chain and had a. Are they called spit, spittle, spittles, or to, to light it? And so then when you turned it, it out, do? you Just pulled the other. How did, did it light it? Did it, did it? Was it some sort of thing? No, 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 no. Just no, a light. Was light it a pilot? Lighters used to go yes. around to do the street lamps using yes. one wicker. Right. Yes. So you started the gas pumping out and then you put a yeah, flame that's up right. and lit it. And then you put the flame up and put that to it because you'd already lit that by something. Well, there was matches then, wasn't there? I can't yeah, remember. Matches, yeah, old matches, yeah. They call them spittles. Paper, they made sort of paper papery things, things, weren't they? And then, because when you went to bed at night, you pulled the other chain and it and went off. Out the, yeah. And that was when we used to go up to bed. And what did night. Isabella say when you wanted to have electricity? Oh, she said, it's so dangerous. You couldn't put it in. My father was an electrician. She said, you can't put electricity. It's so dangerous. You couldn't put it in, possibly. And she thought gas was safer than oh, electricity. Oh, yes. <laughs> you can imagine, can't you? <laughs> no, she wouldn't let him do it. But eventually he did, because when she died, and that was it. Yeah. And did she have curtains up at the... And there was big shutters, wooden shutters. Yeah, they, there were shutters, shutters that they gone. gone yeah. So they yes. didn't have but the windows looked exactly the same as they were. They um, did, they same didn't have no, I can never remember curtains. So just the shutters. Yes. I think the shutters... Yes, I can they, never remember curtains. They've been taken curtains. out, but I think they might be still in there. We haven't looked, but that, that's got the same depth. Yes, they seem to come out from this way, I think. Not from that. Okay, no, they were definitely... Definitely. Like you would get outside on French buildings, yes, but that's inside. Right. inside. Oh, really? That's it. Mm. Yeah. Oh, really because it. I thought um, with a these concertina have, um, sort of cover. Yes, they well, just came over, didn't they? Because the, the things Split. inside have got extra pulleys. Do you see 
Yes, yes, okay. the extra ones, yeah. So somebody said what probably happened was they came up. Mm. I don't remember the pulleys. No, I don't remember. I remember so, just the one sash line. So it. what's the pulleys for? <coughs> yeah. No idea. No. Unless there was a blind that came down. Yes. And that one down. I'm, I'm but sure. Why would you have two? Problems. So that bit in the in in that there that comes out, mm. that isn't anything that comes out. I well, I don't remember it just that. They would I, have been ones I, that fell. I, I remember them as Barry oh, said, something really you see on the ground. Yes. yes. Oh, I'd love to have some. I'm like sure that. they were. Because <laughs> you can buy them now with slats in, can't you? These yeah, wooden shutters. Yeah, but I'd now. like the ones like yes, the French Yes, yes, that's right. Yes, that they were. Yeah, I'm sure they came in and didn't come out. And did they, Positive, do you think they were full length or were oh, they Oh yes, half? they were, well, covered the window because to yeah. keep the cold out. So they were, the they were yeah. like that? Yeah, I'd say it probably you, you didn't just do half. half. No, yeah. no, 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 there were a whole lot of oh, yeah. yeah. yes. I'm sure they were by yes. Yes. yes, yes. Oh, what well, a shame they didn't was. leave those in. Yeah. Well, you wouldn't, yeah. would you? Well, you I would. Well, when I say you. Wonderful. Only because this room looks so much smaller than what it was. Even though it's actually twice the size, really, because it goes yeah, all the way to... It's it it so much smaller. <laughs> and the, the settee was here, an armchair there. My sister used to sit there and watch the telly, which was over there. Right. And she used to do her homework and watch the television. She went to Tunbridge Grammar School. Mm -hmm. But she still came out with flying colours. <laughs> How she could do that, I do not know. So she's in... South Africa. She's in South Africa. Oh, right. yes, right. Do you remember what they had on the floor? What? Did carpet. they have carpet? Yes, it was uh, carpet. Yeah. I don't know about you. Just rugs. Like rugs itself. Yes. Definitely yeah. wasn't this floor. This is obviously the original. No, this is the original. This is the original. Floor. Yeah. You, you no, yeah. It wasn't like that. Yeah, yeah. You no, would, I mean, I'm you wouldn't sure get carpet. wide floorboards like this anymore. No, you wouldn't. No. 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 I, no. Think it was, I think it was actually painted a dark colour around the edge, mm. so the carpet may yeah, have I'm gone positive it was carpet. to the edge. Yes, yes. So how yes. long have you both been here then? Is it seven, seven years now? Seven years, oh, I think, seven yeah. Years. yeah. When, when we walked into the house and we looked round, um, there was just a lovely feeling, wasn't there? There was a kind of feeling of home, which... Mm. Well, well, as I say, we've moved 18 times in 54 years, 55 years, so... We, we, all, we know this, don't There's we? As soon as you walk in, you get a feeling, Yeah, there was that you? feeling. Yes. And he spoke to the, the um, doctor's wife, didn't we? Yes. And she uh, was so positive and she said, oh, I loved living there. Well, Cameron's wife. Yeah, it was a lovely house. Because his first house. wife died, didn't she? And I think so. Married. Yes, that's right. And she was so nice about it. And mm. then we met the Roses and they yes. loved it. They, they... So you've met the Roses? Yes. Well, I'm sure they owned an Armongus in Camden Road. I'm positive they did, because they brought it off of you, didn't they, or Mum and Dad? Yeah. Interesting to know. If but you know, I've, but I, I, did, I told you that the house was very came within a whisker of all being demolished, didn't I? No. Ah. Oh, yes. Well, it's basically they had this big plan. I'm, I'm still not quite sure when it was. It was about 15 years ago. Yes. And it was to demolish all these houses, use the house. vicar's garden to build you know, a whole series of modern, modern houses. And it all had all gone through planning. So it was all about to happen. <gasps> And Anya, who lives down the road, was working at the South Society, you know, they were looking at the plans, and they discovered there was one measurement in the plan that was wrong. So it wow. said it was 20 yards or something like that from the listed building, which is the old dairy. Yes. And actually it was only 20 feet, or I can't remember the figure, it was 60 feet or something, but because it, they got the feet and metres wrong, it was a material difference. Wonderful. So it had to go all the way back to planning, delayed it two months, and by that time the developer had lost interest. Oh. So Louise, you see, had not really maintained the house because she thought it was going to be demolished. Yes. Mm. yes. I mean, that staircase used to look an enormous so staircase. <laughs> <laughs> it was tiny. Yeah. It really did. Mm. Is that still the bathroom? Yeah, that's the bathroom. Oh, did, did Dad put the bathroom? I the, think so. The yeah. bathroom, it didn't used to be, you know. The bathroom was like a Frankenstein place when we came oh. in. It had all these switches and things. Uh, well, the bath was this way or that way, Barry? I don't know. It had been it very big. Way. I think it was that way. It's barely long enough. Yeah. No, I think it was. Was it there? Do you no, know it was, I can't it remember. Came the, the bath window across this way. Is it? Yeah. Is there? You see, I can't remember. You see, when we came in against that wall, yeah. was. It was a bit like Carry On, one of those Carry On films with all yeah, these switches. Was what was it? Carry On Screaming. It had all these switches. switches. Most of them said not in use. Can you remember that? I can't remember it was, that. So that's where the... I thought it was just big enough for... It was a bathroom, a bathroom and a basin, basin yeah. wasn't yeah. that? No, 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 no.